Yeah, all right, boys, now that we're not so fucking poor, I think it's time to go grind some more money because we can't really afford a different engine. Unless, unless, how, are, how is everything doing? Everything is doing okay. I mean, it's not really 45% of the front, 68 on the rear, but I think our best... A best thing the best thing we can do is maybe just build the engine ourselves <sighs> hopefully the game doesn't crash oh, it didn't crash right so we can put let's especially now that we can see what kind of engine we can put we can put a VR38 into this 2JZ we can't put a stroker kit into it but I don't think this necessarily needs a stroke oh 2JZ GTE and 2JZ GTE 3.2, billet 3.5, SR20 engines, I don't know, we can put a boxer engine into this thing, S85 B50, oh dude, should I put an S85 B50 into this thing, RBs, should I put an RB into this, because technically speaking, this is a Nissan, boys, this is a Nissan, I don't know, most people go with the, or maybe should I just build a LLS, Another two Jay-Z. How many fucking two Jay-Zs? Oh, I, I, said it, I thought it said probably Stroker. I was like, <laughs> probably? <laughs> Shouldn't you not? Should you know if it's a Stroker kit or not? I think an LS might not be a bad idea. You know, I'm, I'm normally very against putting LSs into good cars. <laughs> but maybe, but since there are 75 different LS motors, I think I'm going to buy a kit. All right, now we are getting into it. GM, LS7, LS9. I don't... I've got no idea. I literally have no idea what the fuck the LS line is. What is a good LS? What is not a good LS? I'm just gonna... So, I'm either going to buy the LS7. It's a 7 liter. <laughs> or I'm gonna buy whatever it's in, whatever's in the Corvette. So, I'm gonna Google Corvette. C7 engine. Oh, it's an LT1. We don't have an LT1. So let's see a Corvette 6. A C6. The C6 uses as L... LS2. LS3. LS7. But I'm buying an LS... Okay, yeah, I'm, I say that, but I don't have enough money. What the fuck was I thinking, dude? I'm just gonna... I can buy an LS1. I can't buy an LS1. But I can buy an LLQ9. Nah, we're saving up. I'm buying a 7-liter LS to put in my fucking drift car. I don't give a fuck, dude. I'm going and doing two, two drifty boys on the, on the street and, uh... Yeah. Alright. Maybe I'll be able to hear the engine sound uh, if, uh, if I buy an LS. Because hell, sure as hell knows, the fucking SR20 sound was broken as fuck, dude. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's see. I'm on Nico circuit, so we, you know, diversify our lives. Obviously, the game's lagging. I've got no idea why I'm not even on the laggy hard drive. Uh, of course, it's not gonna fucking... It's got a problem with the starting, this engine. Since it's got them problems with the startings. Why is that fucking guy in my car? Then I not remove him? Why do I think I removed him? Maybe I removed him somewhere else. Right, I'll, I'll, third gear clutch kick, come on. This is a high speed track, like I cannot get away being in second gear. By the way, as you can, I, I'm drifting and the game's not giving me points. I mean, right now it is, but I mean. Why is it lagging so much? Though? Like, I don't understand though. It's obviously something to do with me recording, but mm, I don't know, I don't care, dude, it's, I swear. Right, I, I set it to two laps, but that should be enough money to buy an LS. That should be enough money to buy an LS. So I'm not, like, I, I, I'm a staunch denier of uh, putting LSs into, motor, into cars, but purely logically speaking, an LS is a solid motor that really just takes, you know, it's got power and it just lives. It lives a good engine. It's genuinely a good engine. I mean, it's not made for this chassis, but as just a drift pig car, as a car that is here just to be drifted, as you look at the car, man, I think we have much more, uh, I think it'd be much better with the LS than, uh, than this thing. 
Especially since... Oh, come on, dude, just start. What the fuck is wrong with this engine, man? Oh, my God. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. We are, we've got some money. We made some money. Drifting is awful right now, but that's fine. I'm, I'm not drifting well, but that's... That's fine, we've made three grand, four thousand dollars. Just like that, we are no longer poor. Man, this was the scuffiest, the most bumpy goddamn start of a fucking series I've ever had, dude. So let's click on this thing and I'll fucking trash it. I don't give a fuck. Three thousand, get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. I'm buying an LS. I don't give a fuck, dude. I don't, I don't necessarily... I'm doing something different. I want to do something different. I don't know why I'm trying to explain myself why I'm buying an LS, but I want to do something different because I'm, um, um, oh damn, look at this thing. It fits, it fits in the engine bay. Can I pop the hood? Oh, that's not the hood, man. There, there you go. Man, it actually genuinely fits. That's nice. It's a, it's a good engine, boys. Small form factor, good power. Let's see how much power. That's the wrong button. Very wrong button. Completely very wrong button. Um, the fuck was the power? How did I forget that? Real wheel drive. It's 463 horsepower. That's not. All. That's not a lot. <laughs> all right, let's put this on uh, E85. I've got the injectors for E85, so we're good. Um, we're gonna put it on E85. Of a fucking, why did I miss it? E85 et et ethanol. Uh, all right. Engine block 9.2. Red line it seems a bit high for <laughs> for a V8. I'm not gonna lie. I'm just gonna keep it open ended. The red line. Four five hundred seventy six is much better. We we. We still need to be over three grand to have the torque, but that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Um, okay. We can always slap a turbo on this, but I don't think turbo LS is the way to go. For now, I think this engine will be sufficient. But first, let me take a selfie. <laughs> you guys remember that meme? That was a very not funny meme, I think. Okay, quickly before the car disintegrates now, I'm going to need to buy some new tires because these are very wasted. And now that we actually can afford some tires, I think that's, uh, that's, that's a very exciting thing, a thing. I really should save before clicking this. I really need to save before clicking this, but I'm going to risk it. Right, we've got tires, brand new tires. Uh, we should have, yep, super sports and drift tires on the rear end. And we got an LS. I think we are... Um, I'm actually pretty keen on trying this thing out again on uh, on uh, Nico. I'm I'm I, I'm like I'm liking Nico. I'm liking Nico. All right, let's see. Oh wait, let me try uh, audio. Let me try getting some audio on this thing. Oh, that sounds awful. Right, so don't forget we are on real wheel drive now. I feel like we need a bit more. Uh... I'm not. I'm not feeling too confident. Oh, there we go, spinning out. My first impressions are that this engine is much better. Oh, I'm. I'm going full focus right now, but. This is a much better engine. That's all I'm gonna say. I'm still not too good on uh, on Nico. Although gearing seems a bit funky, it's spinning really hard. It's definitely spinning a lot of wheels. I don't know how much, you know, realistically in real life, the LS is a very solid engine that can take a lot of beating, like the VQ35, or the VR, or the HR35, the fucking 350Z engine. These are engines that can take a lot of beating, but this is SLRR, and I'm just banging off 8K RPM. 
I'm gonna make this all wheel drive. I mean, it's fucking, it's, it's boring to drift like this. Sure, it needs more precision and you need to be better and you can make it good like with throttle control and everything, but... <laughs> I don't know if you guys know this, but I stop talking when I need to completely fucking focus on the drifting. And this shit with a controller is really not... It's not the most precise thing. If I had a proper wheel, dude, I'd definitely try it, but... Right now, I don't have a proper wheel, and probably never gonna wheel. No, I'm, not, I'm probably never going to have one. Um, so, let's see if I can make this thing a bit all-wheel drive. Just a bit, though. Okay, good. Oh, it's a completely open LIZ. It's a completely open. Let's make it a bit harder. Yeah, that might have been a problem as well. <laughs> right, well, this is gonna do it for today, guys. Um, I'm excited. I'm ex I need to remove this pea shooter and make it a proper uh, exhaust... I'm gonna even remove it now because I don't like how it looks. We need a proper exhaust to, uh, seek the, you know, to go with the V8. I'm excited. It's gonna be different, and we'll see how uh, how things will go. Sixty percent, ninety percent. Headers are okay. Whatever, dude. Whatever. Whatever. How much? Three hundred. Fucking whatever. Thank you for watching, and I'm excited to see your guys' input on uh, what's happening here and what I should maybe tweak and not tweak. Although, chances are I'm going to record a video before this video goes up. Another drift episode, so uh, I don't know. Thank you for watching, and I shall see you in the next one.